Hi, good evening everyone. This is your host Trevor and uh, welcome to the first in a series of presentations at the Practical Performance Analyst. I set up the website a few months ago with the objective of creating awareness about performance engineering, creating a body of knowledge that would essentially serve as a repository for individuals with interests in different aspects of performance engineering and also basically to dispel a whole lot of myths that exist with regards to performance engineering. So in, in this presentation today the objective is to walk you through the mission, what is it we are trying to do, who is it we are trying to address, what are the different initiatives we are trying to um, we, we are trying to basically get into as far as practical performance analyst is concerned and it, eventually what is it that you as the community as an interested user could basically do in terms of participation so I'll move on to the agenda slide um, the presentation should last around 20 minutes this again as I was mentioning was first in a whole series of presentations um, in which I intend to basically cover different aspects of performance, talk about the technical, non-technical, business aspects of performance and as far as this presentation is concerned talk to you about our intentions, our mission, our audience and how you as the community can actually help out. So the agenda for the presentation is define the practical performance analyst, what is it we, we, we define and how is it that we define the practical performance analyst. We then move to talking about what is it that practical performance analyst has to offer, what is the site all about, what is the community all about, what are the different initiatives we are talking about, what is our mission, what is it that we are trying to achieve, who is our audience, why are we doing what we are doing and how is it that individuals like yourself can help. So in a summary, in the next 20-25 minutes, I aim to address the concepts of practical performance analyst. Why is it that we're investing the time and energy in creating practical performance analyst? What do we intend to achieve out of this at the end of the day? Who is our customer? Who is the audience? And how can someone like yourself contribute in making this a successful platform? So let's start out by quickly defining who is a practical performance analyst and what is it we mean by a practical performance analyst. So let's, I'll quickly draw your attention to the definition um, as defined at Wikipedia. Performance engineering, let's start out by looking at performance engineering. Performance engineering is defined as a set of roles, skills, activities, practices, tools and deliverables applied at every phase of the system's development life cycle or software development life cycle which ensures that a solution will be designed, implemented and operationally supported to meet the non-functional requirements for the given solution. So performance engineering my dear friends is a science that consists of different processes across the software development life cycle that aim to ensure that the end product meets its non-functional requirements. So in a nutshell that is what performance engineering is all about. It's, it's, it's a whole set of processes, skills, roles, activities, deliverables that are focused on delivering a solution that meets the non-functional requirements. So as a practicing performance engineer, what kind of roles would you typically what type of what are the typical roles that it would consist of a practical a practicing performance engineer typically could perform any one of the following roles a performance architect a individual with interest in performance modeling a capacity planner a capacity manager a performance tester an application performance monitoring architect or a diagnostics and tuning engineer of course i mean I, I, it's impossible to cover all the different roles from a performance engineering standpoint but I've tried my best 
to bucketize roles into the following areas. So a practical performance analyst is a performance engineer with interest in one of these areas, either a performance architect or a capacity planner, a capacity manager, performance tester, a diagnostic and tuning expert, an application monitoring guru. A practical performance analyst is an individual with a practical point of view. But more importantly, a practical performance analyst could also potentially be an individual who has been associated with performance in one way or the other and has appreciation for the challenges of dealing with performance and aspires to work in one of the areas mentioned about. So performance engineering consists of different activities that address performance across the software development lifecycle and practical performance analysts are individuals with interest in one or a combination of different aspects across the software development lifecycle from a performance engineering standpoint. So what is practical performance analyst all about? The whole idea of setting up practical performance analyst was to dispel the myth that performance engineering is rocket science. It is not a rocket science. It's a very well-defined science. Um, it's, it's easy to understand. Um, there are a whole lot of complicated aspects surrounding it but we'll do our best to dispel the myths and present the information in an easy to understand way um, the other objective of, of practical performance analysts is to create a body of knowledge for performance engineering which has been missing in all these years as a performance engineer working with different clients across the globe i've had the opportunity to look at challenges from a customer standpoint, challenges from a performance engineer standpoint. And it's always been a big challenge trying to get hold of documents, trying to get hold of information that help you address or help you understand processes that you could use to address performance to address performance challenges across the customer environment. So the whole idea of practical performance analysis is to create a body of knowledge define a set of processes which potentially can be leveraged by individuals who have similar challenges. It is also to communicate performance engineering concepts in a very simple and lucid way. Define performance engineering processes and documents and create reusable process templates so that individuals don't have to re reinvent the wheel. And I think at the end of the day, what's really, really important is for us to dispel the myth that performance engineering is rocket science. It definitely isn't rocket science. It's an easy to understand concept. A lot of performance engineering is plain old common sense. And I think as we, over the next few years, if not months, I will, along with the rest of the team, aim to, aim to document processes and present reusable process templates that will help you um, uh, implement performance engineering processes in your own industries, in your own workplaces. The other objective is to create a platform that indus engages industry experts, gets, gives a voice to performance engineers around the world, and creates a community where individuals with related interests from a performance engineering standpoint can come together and share their experiences. From a community standpoint, I think it's very important that we help other perform aspiring performance engineers in understanding what their career options are. It's really, really important that we help potential practical performance analysts understand what their options are and guide them in the right direction. The other aspect of practical performance analysts is to give product vendors the ability to reach out to the community out there by participating in discussions, sharing information on product launches, and offering a preview of next generation products and solutions while using the community as an invaluable focus group to get feedback. And of course, at the end of the day, um, practical performance analysts will offer a lot of content across different areas of performance engineering. So what is our mission? If I were to summarize it, our mission is to create a body of knowledge for performance engineering, create awareness on the various facets of performance engineering across the software development lifecycle, create a bridge between vendors and adopters and users of performance engineering rel related solutions offer unbiased views on products, technologies, concepts, paradigms related to performance, create a strong community with the intention of sharing knowledge and helping others learn, 
assist potential performance engineers by providing them guidance on potential career options eventually create a market for skills in the performance engineering space and bring together industry experts to share knowledge and insight on significant issues of the day so who is our audience who is our customer our customer our audience is someone like yourself who has interest in the performance engineering space as a stakeholder as an advisor a solution implementer an architect um, or a performance analyst himself of course these interests would be across one of the following domains either in performance requirements gathering performance modeling performance optimization application diagnostics performance testing performance monitoring capacity planning or capacity management so our audience in a sense is an individual is the individual who has some sort of stake in any one of these following concepts across the performance engineering life cycle including potential candidates and individuals who are interested in making a career working in one of the areas mentioned above so why are we doing this at the end of the day we do I'm, uh, the this the practical performance analyst is to create a body of knowledge that can be refined by industry experts and referenced over time by individuals around the world so that they don't have to reinvent the wheel i found myself reinventing the wheel the first few years there was a lot of information available out there in small pockets but unfortunately none of this none of the information is well documented well presented in an easy to understand way of course i have benefited through a lot of publications by renowned authors like dr neil gantha dr connie smith dr daniel menas and a few others um but at the end of the day it's really really important for us to ensure that others don't reinvent the wheel and i think over the next few years working with the rest of my team i put together i we aim to put together a body of knowledge that will be refined and referenced and that can be referenced by individuals with potential needs or interests in performance the other important aspect is to dispel the myth that performance engineering is rocket science it definitely isn't and one of the reasons why it is considered to be rocket science is the pure lack of skills lack of understanding lack of documentation and the lack of easy to understand concepts the other the other objective is to bring together a community of individuals with similar interests so that we can share and learn from each other's experiences to create a bridge between product vendors and product adopters and i think this is really really important it's great for us as a community of practitioners to preach about the good of performance to preach about the importance of investing in practical performance but at the end of the day if we don't bridge the gap between people who manufacture the products and people who implement the products we wouldn't have achieved our objective so i think it's really important while we focus on building the community we bring not just the end adopters but also the manufacturers to the table and create the bridge between the adopters and the product vendors the other objective is to help potential practical performance analysts understand what their career options are and help the experienced practical performance analysts or performance engineers out there to venture into potentially other areas of performance which otherwise they wouldn't have had the option to get into offer mentoring and guidance to individuals seeking to learn more and of course advocate performance and practical performance and proactive performance to all our clients so how can you help each one of you can help in small ways from a side perspective contribute to building of the body of knowledge refine the content out there provide feedback improve on it contribute articles product reviews how to's documentation with regards to your interest i mean your interest could be in any one of the areas across performance it could be performance requirements performance modeling performance testing capacity management um capacity planning etc contribute articles product reviews how to's in each one of in in any of those areas from a community perspective 
help build the community, offer mentoring to potential candidates, recruit other practical performance analysts, and of course spread the word. So at the end of the day, practical performance analyst is a platform for potential performance engineers, for aspiring performance engineers, and for other performance engineers who strongly believe that reinventing the wheel is not the way to go. The objective of practical performance analyst is to document various different facets of performance, share the knowledge that we've gained over the years, learn from the mistakes that others have made, and build a strong community and bridge the gap between product vendors and product adopters. Thanks for taking the time. Um, this is Trevor from Practical Performance Analyst signing off. Um, and until the next video cast, cheers.